Did you know that Prince Harry will soon divorce Meghan Markle as he's already consulting with divorce lawyers? Despite the King's shocking cancer diagnosis, Meghan's asking him to choose between her and the King. The Duke of Sussex is reportedly so fed up with his wife that he's considering ending their marriage for good. Even more juicy is that Meghan knows that their marriage is doomed and is therefore trying to manipulate Harry into a position where she'll get total custody over the children and a huge chunk of his money. Royal sources have revealed that their relationship is so bad that Harry has two escape rooms, a bungalow and a hotel that he goes to alone just to get away from Meghan when she's being mean and nasty. Experts have said Harry was wise to have traveled to the UK without Meghan after the King's cancer diagnosis. She can't even go visit her sick father-in-law. It is that bad. But what are the reasons behind their marital crisis, and why is it inevitable that they will soon divorce? In this video, we'll reveal the shocking truth about Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's relationship, and why they're heading for a messy and expensive split. You'll learn about the secrets, scandals, and rumors that have plagued their marriage since they tied the knot in 2018. You will also discover how Meghan Markle's been controlling and manipulating Prince Harry and how he's been feeling miserable and trapped in their marriage. We'll also tell you about what he does whenever Meghan pushes him to the wall. And if you stick around long enough, we'll also talk about his recent actions which some interpret as indicators that he may soon resolve his rift with his family and move back to the UK. You might want to grab your coffee because we have a truckload of juicy royal scandals that will blow your mind. So let's get started. As we mentioned earlier, Prince Harry already made the shocking decision to consult with divorce lawyers. This was revealed by Lady Colin Campbell, a royal author and commentator who's close to the British royal family and who's even written a book on why Prince Harry and Meghan stepped down from the royal duty. She claimed that she had at least five insider sources who confirmed the shocking news of Prince Harry's consultation with divorce lawyers. Lady C and some other insider sources also revealed that Prince Harry has two escape rooms that he goes to alone when he's fed up with Meghan Markle. One of them is a swanky San Vicente bungalow which is located about 100 miles away from their family home in Montecito. The other escape room for Prince Harry is secretly reserved in a luxury hotel that is not far from the family's mansion as well. But why is Prince Harry so miserable with Meghan Markle, and why does he need to escape from her? Well, there are many reasons why Harry and Meghan's marriage is doomed to fail. Here are some of the main ones. Prince Harry's marriage is headed for the rocks because he regrets stepping down from his royal duties and misses living in the UK as he feels isolated and alienated in his new life, and he blames his opportunistic wife for it all. From the looks of things, he was influenced by Meghan to step down from royal duties and abandon his family in the UK because of Meghan's desire for a celebrity lifestyle in the US as against a royal lifestyle in the UK. Meghan wanted to use her royalty as a platform to further promote her Hollywood ambitions and become a global celebrity. Hence, she exploited Prince Harry's grudge against his family and convinced him to betray them publicly by staging a series of interviews, a Netflix documentary, and writing a scandalous book which she titled Spare. Meghan was sure that after all these media scandals, Prince Harry can't return home and has no choice but to stick with her no matter what. It's a classic case of crossing to America and burning the bridge behind him. Another issue Prince Harry has is that ever since he married Meghan, Harry's been involved in a series of controversies and scandals that have damaged his reputation and image. He's been accused of being hypocritical, ungrateful, and disrespectful to the royal family and the British public. He's also been criticized for his political activism, his vendetta against his family, and his beef against the British media. He's lost the trust and affection of his fans and friends who feel that he's changed for the worse because of Meghan's influence. The third reason why Prince Harry will soon call it quits with Meghan is the result of the first two points mentioned earlier. The prince feels miserable after realizing that he's trapped on all sides in his marriage. That's why he's so miserable to the extent that he can't even hide it or pretend to be happy when he's with Meghan at public functions. He has now become notorious for always wearing a miserable face whenever they attend public events together, as well as almost always in the company of her mother. Speaking of Meghan's mother, she's the fourth reason why Prince Harry's fed up with his marriage. And that's because Miss Doria Ragland is an intrusive mother-in-law who rarely leaves the royal couple alone to spend time together. Wherever you see Prince Harry and Meghan at any public event, Miss Ragland can't be far behind. Imagine being the husband and there's no event you attend in which your mother-in-law won't tag along for the ride. You'll certainly be pissed too, right? It's like getting married to both the daughter and the mother. They both literally feed off his popularity. That's more reason Harry looks miserable during most of their outings. A good example that has since gone viral was his unhappy I'd rather be anywhere else look at the Beyonce concert which they attended in September of last year. 
Despite Meghan and her mom having a great time because of the amazing performance by Beyonce, the runaway prince looked like he wasn't informed it was a concert and not a funeral service. Netizens had a great time reacting to his obvious look of misery and unhappiness. Sources close to the couple revealed that Meghan was so upset by Prince Harry's look of unhappiness at the concert that she had to tell him to stop embarrassing her with his look. He ought to at least pretend to be happy for her sake and her mother's sake. These are just some of the reasons why Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's marriage is falling apart, why they're heading for a divorce. Many royal experts and insiders have predicted that their marriage will not last and that they will soon announce their separation. For example, Dr. Louise Mahler, a body language and communication expert, said that she noticed signs of tension and distance between Prince Harry and Meghan Markle and that they looked unhappy and uncomfortable together. She said that their body language showed that, my prediction is this ain't gonna last if it hasn't broken up already. Another expert, Angela Levin, a British royal author and commentator, also blamed Meghan Markle for ruining Prince Harry's life. She says they're absolutely separating and it's the beginning of the end. Another source close to the royal family who believes the two would soon split is Paul Burrell, the man who was Princess Diana's butler until her death in 1997. He believes Harry's only hanging on to the marriage because of the children, Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet. But for how long? There are also many signs that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have already given up on their marriage and that they're living separate lives. For example, they did not publicly acknowledge or celebrate their fifth wedding anniversary on May 19th last year. Many were shocked by the couple's refusal to publicly acknowledge their anniversary, since this was a major milestone for any couple. Maybe they're saving up the sweet words and romantic pictures for this year's anniversary. We'll see. Another most recent and clear sign that their marriage is ending is that Prince Harry recently traveled to the UK alone to visit his father, King Charles, who was recently diagnosed with cancer while he was undergoing separate treatment for prostate enlargement. Harry didn't go along with his wife, despite how serious and urgent the king's medical condition was. Many royal commentators praised him for this decision and said that it was wise for him to go without Meg, who would have caused more trouble and drama. They also said that this was a sign that Prince Harry was trying to reconnect with his family and that he was distancing himself from Meghan. While many are optimistic that Prince Harry's ready to reconcile with his father, especially at a time when he's having such serious health problems, it's also reported that Meghan isn't pleased with this move. Angela Levine says Meghan won't be pleased whatsoever if Harry were to rebuild his relationship with the king. And who can blame Harry? Reconciling with his family seems to be the only way out of his misery and confined marriage. Given recent events and the clear-cut signs, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are headed for divorce and it seems nothing can stop it. Prince Harry's faced with the difficult decision of choosing between pleasing Meghan and staying in a doomed marriage or retake back his mantle as Duke while reconciling with the king and family. Looks like we'll have to wait and see.